Hi, I'm Jacob Waddell. I'm a student at Georgia Tech. I've been coming to Cedar Crest for about four or five years and been part of high school ministry serving there for a year. So life before Jesus, I grew up in church as a kid, not really like consistently going to church all the time, but I knew of Jesus, but I didn't really have that personal relationship until about like two years ago in college. One night I had a rough night partying and I just like look around and I just see like people just moving around like zombies, not really living their life. And I was just thinking to myself, why am I doing this? It's just like useless, a waste of time. I realized I was just in a toxic environment. I just like kind of had this moment with God where I was like, something needs to change in my life. So I just, the next day, just dedicated to pursue that direction. I got invited to church, so I went to church. And then it was kind of just that like moment realizing like, oh, I've wasted all these years of my life doing whatever. And then I kind of like pivoted and switched forward and explore like, what's the next step and going further. Things in my life that changed are just being more like peaceful and just being in comfort in Jesus's presence and just developing those fruits of the spirit instead of leading down the path of destruction. Just seeing how my life changed in those aspects just wanted me to pursue that further. So like through taking those steps, one thing I really re noticed that's helped me a lot is serving and then joining a life group, just having that accountability. And it just really showed me what true community was instead of outside of partying, just having fun, but people who hold you accountable and actually love you for who you are and show you the right path towards Jesus. And then just serving, it holds me accountable and helps me realize my gifts and talents and how I can bring that for the glory of God. So I wanna um, get baptized to show the community that I'm dying to my old self and leaving that path of destruction and going through the narrow gate towards life with Jesus. My name's Jacob and I've decided to follow Jesus. Well, good morning, Cedar Crest. Uh, my name is Cody Harmon. I'm one of the Life Group uh, pastors here, and I've actually had the privilege of knowing Jacob since he was in high school, which I just realized. So uh, we're both getting old, so that's, that's sick. Um, but, uh, but just, man, just getting to see uh, your relationship with Jesus grow, and like you said in your video, you know, of going to school and trying to figure all of this out for yourself, and, and then even today, you know, taking the, the hope of Jesus, making it your own, and deciding to follow him is awesome. And so we're so excited to celebrate with you uh, this morning with that. Uh, and so I just have two questions for you uh, this morning. And so one is, have you decided decided to follow Jesus? Yes. Yes. And have you committed to follow him the rest of your life? Yes. Awesome. Well, man, it is my honor to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with him in death, raised to walk a brand new life. Congratulations, man. Congratulations. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. Wait, would you join me in praying over Jacob uh, this morning as we finish our time? God, thank you for Jacob. God, thank you for the way that you um, have worked in his life. God, the way that you um, ha have encountered him and God, the way that, that he has just followed through in obedience and, and wanting to follow you and pursue um, you with his whole life. And so God, we pray that from this day forward, God, that as he is following you, God, that you would use him to bring other people to you, God, that you would reveal more of yourself to him, God, that his life would never be the same because of what you are doing in and through him. And so God, we thank you for Jacob and that we get to celebrate with him this morning. It's in your name we pray. Amen. Amen.